man that has three YouTube channels, three books, and one of the busiest schedules I know, but he managed to fit me in, it's Alfie Dave. And I've been making these weird little creations under the name Pointless Blog. That is simply because they are pointless and they are video blogs. Well, I really want to know all about you, mm -hmm. your world, and how it all created. It started like seven years ago. Um, I've watched tons of videos online for years and years and years. Um, and I've been watching people who make like vlogs and okay. just sit down, film every day of their life and stuff. And I just thought one day I'll give it a go myself. So I stacked up a load of books in my bedroom, <laughs> didn't tell any of my friends or family, and uh, just filmed my first vlog. What was the one thing that you really wanted to do before you became a vlogger? Is there a different path that you could have taken? Yeah. Well, in college, I did chemistry, maths, biology, and geography. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, it's a very, very science based. Yeah. Um, yeah, I don't know. I wanted to maybe be like a dentist or um, eco scientist, something like okay. that. Okay. Yeah. Have you and then I started vlogging. I was like, this is so fun. I was going to do this. <laughs> Dip my finger in it and steal the cookie dough. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. You managed to have a super famous <laughs> online girlfriend as yeah. well. I mean, you and Zoella, you've done loads of amazing videos together. Yeah. But then how do you both fit in time to be in a relationship, yeah. make videos, no, this is the edit thing. videos? This is the thing. If we're like doing something, I'm like, wait, do I want to be filming this or do I want to just share the moment with you? Yeah, or like, do I want to share it with all of these guys watching the video? Like, <laughs> it, it's hard. It's really, really hard. Wow. But, um, if you have a really bad day, do you feel like, actually, I don't want people to know about no, that? No, because I or... want people to know, because I want it to be okay. realistic. Like, yeah. I, I don't want, I, that's the one thing I've made really, really clear to my audience, is I don't want the, like, the ideal life. I don't want to be like the goals. I want to be like a normal person. Yeah. That's what I am. Oh my gosh, why am I even doing this? Hello. Yo, guys. Yo, guys. How does it feel having a figure in one of the biggest, like, museums in the world? I know and knowing that you reached that level in your life. The first time I ever thought about my wax figure, like obviously I did the <laughs> launch and everything. Yeah. But then once that's done, like I don't go back and look at it. <laughs> <laughs> it just is what it is now, it's just there. I feel like me and you watching this video, we can do it together. Let's make this year even better than last year. Do you ever worry about views? I try and just ignore the views because okay, it's yeah. too easy to get caught up in yes. the numbers. And that's the one thing that I say when people are starting out, I'm always like, don't worry about the views, like the views will come. Definitely. I yeah. mean, I have loved meeting you and thank you for the tips. But before we go, mm -hmm. I mean, you're no stranger to a, to a challenge. So what we're going to do is, I'm actually quite excited about this. Yeah. The after eight challenge. Game Let's on. Do Let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> okay, so basically take the chocolate. Yeah. Put it on your forehead. Right. And then cool. you have to get it into your mouth. Three, two, one, go. Yeah, there's definitely oh. chocolate on my... <laughs> I'm gonna eat it. Victory. <laughs>